Hi guys, Mojo Rufus here and today we're gonna take a closer look at Mafex Harley Quinn. Let's go! So here's a quick look at the box, at the back Harley Quinn, different poses. I really like that she comes with three different head sculpts. Would be nice if she came with just one with blonde hair loose and all white. Just a regular head sculpt, but this is dope. So yeah, side, front. I really dig the comic pages inside the box. Mayfax is stepping up. I really, really like the comic Mayfax figures. So she comes with this one. Uh, relaxed looking face I really really like the paint job on the head sculpt and here we got a little bit more angry face grinning a little bit I really like this one two closed fists relaxed hands pointing fingers semi relaxed hands and holding hands for her hammer wish she came with trigger fingers but it's okay the magic bouncy feet would be nice if they added another pair of these with the this a little bit more loose a little bit more extended so you can play with it as if she's really bouncing but yeah it's a nice effect a little extra touch on the inside it's a little bit plain here she is it's a really nice looking figure really like the colors really really like the head sculpt but yeah, it's a really nice articulation. I really like this bo uh, female bot for comic figures. Hope they start using it on a little bit more realistic figures that are coming. Still need to grab that uh, MCU Captain Marvel. Shoulders are okay. Mine's a little bit stiff. Still need to heat it up a little bit. Silicon oil to open it up leg drop down can go pretty far up and if you use this one she can actually oh no it will pop out so up till here you can get her in crazy clownish poses and yeah with the other feet the bouncy ones and maybe the psycho head sculpt So yeah, that's nice. Crazy running pose. That's nice. And this is the hammer that she comes with, so let's pop it off. Let's take a closer look at the hammer. It's not that much to look at, but I really like it. It's a little bit heavy. Uh, chrome, red effects. Little small black lines in between, which are nice. I got a closed fist hand on top so it can hold it and this one also comes in black so you can switch the hands and here so yeah let's compare with other Harley Queens and here she is with the Harley Queen from DC icons and here she is with the DC collectibles uh, old school animated uh, the Batman show Harley Quinn uh, yeah I really like these three together um, with these three next to each other if you cannot afford a Mayfax or you don't want to spend too much money on a Harley Quinn figure I still really really recommend the DC icons Harley Quinn the head sculpt the paint is very nice articulation is there uh, you might have to make a couple cuts on the inside and the upper torso and that's it it's a great figure head sculpt's really nice comes with a couple accessories not too much couple hands hammer I thought a gun but one head sculpt but yeah if you can afford a Mayfax don't miss on this hot on this hush Harley Queen
because I really really think she is great and with the Joker uh, I used to post this DC icons Hollywood the Mayfax Joker but yeah this this new Mayfax figure really really matches really nice with the new Joker figure so yeah don't miss out on this one and here we have Batman Harley Quinn and Catwoman all from Mayfax hush I still think that this Mayfax Catwoman has probably one of the best female comic Mayfax figures bodies and I really like the sculpt from this Batman the cape the head sculpt it screams Batman so yeah and this Joker I really like the head sculpts on this guy the open mouth it's a little bit too much light on this guy might give it a wash so his face doesn't seem all white but yeah once you have him posed with all the purple and the red in his face he kind of stands out so let's zoom back in with all the other characters yeah there he is a little bit better but yeah I really think Mayfax line and the Hush line is really great and of course of course of course we got this guy the Holy Grail did a, I did a repaint on this guy so his muscle belly is popped a little bit more his head sculpt a little bit more toned so looks a little bit more buff a little bit more comic accurate and yeah it's probably my favorite Superman figure ever uh, I really like the sculpt the look cape everything yeah dope fig and here she is next to the Mayfax Batman and the Mayfax Joker I really think the Joker and her look really really nice together and here she is next to my uh, comic Mayfax Superman uh, looks really dope together uh, gotta mix and match but I think this can work out with cool comic poses and here we got Batgirl uh, this was the DC collectibles I thought it's an old figure I did a lot of cutting and uh, made sure it fits in with the 112 as you can see she fits in really nice with the other girls and with Batman and stuff so let me hold it like this let me see uh, here we got bats so yeah as you can see she's even smaller than him and works out really well and black cat Mavex Hush and of course Harley herself so yeah, really like this lineup, and I'm really hyped for James Gunn uh, Supergirl movie. So yeah, I really hope DC does well, and I hope he kind of leaves the games alone. I really don't like the way uh, game industry was working back in the day. We got a superhero movie, then we got a superhero game, superhero movie, superhero game. And the games were always whack man and the one time they were good they were really good like the ps2 spider-man game and i actually kind of like the wolverine movie game but yeah ah, just two games but <laughs> i really wish they uh step it up uh i thought the new arkham knights was really let down i was really hyped after playing years of uh, Arkham Batman I was stoked we finally have a new game especially on PS5 and yeah it wasn't really that well but let's uh, hope the new Suicide Squad game does well and here she is riding on the back of Doomsday this is my custom Doomsday I used the old head sculpt from Builder Figure Wave with the new McFarlane fully repainted added a couple spikes and stuff and yeah this screams doomsday for me 
And here she is riding on his back, like yeehaw, let's go. <laughs> on to the battle. So yeah, I really uh, I really like this Harley Quinn. I think this looks like uh, a lot of fun. It's a fun figure to play around with, especially with the Joker. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. Don't miss out on this Mayfix Harley Quinn figure. Job bless, stay healthy, go work out. And yeah, thanks for watching again. Later guys.